Here's a quick demo of mock turn. Um, I got a touch screen here. I can turn on my spindle. Turn it off. Turn it back on. Um, I could adjust the speed here if I had to. Or we can just use the pendant. That's 30 full speed right there. You see I'm driving that at 75 hertz. And then, It'll, it's pretty responsive motor. I don't have a braking braking resistor right now, but um, if the RPM isn't exactly on, um, Mach will bring it up a little bit to 1068. Just takes a couple seconds. It'll uh, adjust it. Come on. Well, it's close enough. There it goes. Well, now it's stabilized. Pretty much at 1068. I can crank it up. I don't really know how useful that is to have it dead on, but it's got the ability to do it. It's not like I care if it's one RPM off or something. Pretty much getting stabilized at 1685. Uh, turn off the spindle. You now you can zero stuff here. And over here. We can uh, switch. We're on X. Jog this around. We'll move it a thousandth of an inch at a time. We can switch to Z here. doesn't miss pulses or anything of it, Mach will keep track of where it is, which is nice. Uh, I can change my step size here if I want. I usually leave it on a thousandth and turn this thing off. That's pretty much it. E-stop works. That's it, thanks.